you asked about investing in, te in how it's going to change tech as well. And, you know, there's, there's four areas where, where AI is really um, making a massive difference. So search is the big one, right? That, that people are catching all the headlines, you know, uh, is the injection of Gen AI into Bing going to take share from Google? Then you've got the injection into software. You know, it used to be that you had a, a, a when I, when I started using software, you had a manual for software, right? <laughs> and that's how you used it and you learned that way. Now software teaches you how to use it, right? Like you do when you have a video game. The third area is cloud infrastructure because all of this AI research and mathematics was from the 1950s. But what's really allowed AI to accelerate is storing data cheaply and processing it cheaply right and and that's the cloud that's what mm. the cloud is enabling and then the final area is is the compute or the or the processors that that do all that processing right so companies like nvidia what's nvidia up 80 percent year to date um on the back of you know very strong demand for for the, for the gpus that it makes but there's mm. you know other other players like amd micron that are also providing and then their i think semis. in terms of i don't know about you guys but i think in terms of companies that apply ai to mm -hmm. their like i thought about you know i were pretty close with the service now team mm. and just listen to it you know and by the way to your comment about mundane tasks many of the things service now does are replacing you know pretty mundane tasks uh, from for businesses business users they're applying it to their products so I you know I think that there you need to think in terms if you're an investor you need to think of peer plays and then you need to think in terms of first and second derivatives which yeah, is something that I think absolutely. a lot of us naturally do yeah. just as a core as part of our job.